and that's why I abstained in the final vote. Thank you, Mr. Stadler. Now, President. President. Well, this is one of the final steps, uh, stepping stones for the accession of Croatia. So I think that uh, one has to look at how long we kept Croatia waiting. Croatia has not occupied uh, part of the territory of another member state, as uh, Turkey has done with Cyprus. Uh, Croatia has never refused to recognize a member state of the European Union. Croatia has done everything possible to uh, fulfill the EU's conditions, even if uh, it wasn't always successful, but it was uh, quite genuine efforts that were made, and nevertheless, Croatia was kept waiting for a long time. So I'm pleased that uh, we're now moving to the final phase, the final lap. I would like to uh, congratulate all of the uh, democratically elected representatives of Croatia who've been elected to this House, and uh, now, uh, because they've been kept waiting for so long. Uh, the uh, turnout uh, was uh, very low. 21% turnout really shows that people are voting with their feet and actually uh, increasingly being uh, reje rejecting uh, Europe the European Union. Thank you. Mr. Ripo is next. Mr. President, I'd like to welcome Croatia to our European Union. There is demand for the European Union and in our neighboring countries they think membership is a good idea. That's great, but 